Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today we're talking about iOS 15. So as we're getting closer to the release of the first beta of iOS 15, of course, we get new leaks and reports regarding the features and the changes that are coming to this big iOS update. So we have some new reports again from iHack to you on Twitter, who is our only source to iOS 15. And of course, his reports have been proven to be very, very accurate when it comes to Apple related stuff. So before I get into these features that we're expecting to see on iOS 15, I just want to ask you guys for a huge favor, leave a like on this video as it really does help out this channel a lot. So let's get started with the new reports regarding iOS 15. All right. First thing, we're talking about a big update that is expected to come to the icons on the home screen of your iOS 15 device. So according to iHack2U on Twitter, new icons will be coming to iOS 15. And not just iOS 15, they will be coming to Watch OS 8 as well. Now, according to iHack2U, these probably will be the same as the ones that we have right now on Mac OS. So basically, we get like that depth look that the icons have on Mac OS Big Sur. So you can see right here, these are the icons that basically we will see on this new update with iOS 15. These are like ported icons from Mac OS and they have that, that depth look and you can see how cool they look. I really like them even though it's not like a big change, like visually they look the same but just have that depth feel to them which I believe makes them look really, really nice. And here we have some extra ones. We have Facebook and Facebook Messenger right there and Instagram, hopefully, the devs will be updating their icons to basically fit iOS 15 once these new icons get released, which will make the device look much, much better than having all kinds of different icons on the device. So again, expect a few icons, maybe all of them to have this new look, the depth look that we see right now on Mac OS Big Sur with iOS 15. Moving on to new features that we're expecting to see on iOS 15, always based on reports. So there is expected to come a new widget, which will be the network widget. And probably there we will see like data, how much data we have used through cellular and maybe even Wi-Fi as well. So right now on iOS 14, there is no such thing. Of course, no stock widget for the data, but we have, of course, from third party apps like this one right here from CPU X it will basically just monitor the usage of the data on your iPhone and display them on a widget, which is kind of cool. And of course it is useful. You will have your usage right there on the home screen. Basically very nice to have there and monitor how much data you're using. Another thing that is expected to come a new widget for the, uh, I expect that to be really interesting. I don't know how Apple will implement that, but probably there will be like a widget from which you can launch different camera modes or something like that. We will have to wait and see for that. All we know right now, of course, always from iHack to you is that there will be also widgets for camera and network as well. If you haven't been following what's going on with the reports regarding the new features that are coming to iOS 15, there have been reports even earlier by iHack2U, again, a very reliable source when it comes to this kind of stuff re regarding Apple software and hardware as well. So we reported by him about new widget sizes that are coming to iOS 15. So we will probably see the one by two and others like different sizes of home screen widgets and according to iHack2, they also will be more interactive, not just being displayed right there on the home screen, probably we will be able to interact with them and do stuff right there on the home screen, not just redirect you directly to the app. Like for example, the battery widget that we have right now, it's not useful at all. You cannot actually do anything here. Why not have like a button here to turn on low power mode or something like that. Other features that are expected to come to iOS 15 is a redesigned control center. Basically, all new redesigned control center is expected to come with iOS 15. Now, here's something that I've put on myself here. This is Prism, a Cydia tweak that you can install 
on devices that have Cydia installed and it might look like this even though we don't have like a report how it will look visually we just know that it will be a new control center but it might look something like this I expect Apple to basically create a more compact control center other things is a new lock screen and we will get also new notifications on the lock screen I believe Apple will start like placing little icons on the on the lock screen where you can just expand to see the notifications for each apps and this is again a Cydia tweak and this is how they might look like even though again for all these features we have reports we know that will be new but we don't have like a visual of how they will look and again this is what I've put here the control center and the new icons right there together they look pretty cool here but Again, we will have to wait and see how the control center will look like. But again, these icons will probably most likely look exactly like the ones that we have right now on Mac OS Big Sur because Apple likes to unify things, make them all the same. And we will most likely get these icons on iOS 15. I'm even surprised we didn't get these on iOS 14 or with an update on iOS 14, but looks like Apple has pushed this update and we will see them coming to, to the new iOS 15. There will be also new updates on iOS 15 on several apps. Probably I, I heard hack to you on Twitter. He said that the settings app will be redesigned, but probably several other apps will be redesigned as well. Of course, the stock apps that come with your iOS device. According to the latest reports, there are rumors that Apple will announce WWDC 2021 really, really soon. So expect in the next few weeks, maybe even days, Apple to basically announce WWDC 2021, which again will be online or all virtual, all online. But it's great to have it here and of course get all the new software that Apple usually presents with WWDC. Now, where can you can you expect it to happen? I expect it to happen on the first or the second week of June as the usual schedule that Apple uses when holding their events on June. So probably June 1st, it most likely will be a Tuesday, maybe even a Monday. So we expect it to happen on June 1st or even June 8th. These are two of the dates that we expect iOS 15 to be presented. Of course, alongside with Watch OS 8 Beta 1 and the new Mac OS Beta. Again, later that day, we will probably be devs will be able to install that beta on their device. And we will have to wait then, of course, a few weeks, probably like a couple weeks for the public beta to be released. So the public can take a look at the new iOS 15. So iOS 15 should be here in around three months from now. We will have the first beta and see all the new cool features that have been reported to come to this new software. Again, if you haven't heard by now, Apple will drop support on iOS 15 for a couple devices. It will be the iPhone 6S and the original SE, which are the oldest devices right now that support iOS 14. They won't support iOS 15. Unfortunately, if you have one of those devices, then there's nothing you can do. You won't be able to install iOS 15 on your device. So again, Probably we will see most of these features that have been reported, if not all of them. And I wouldn't be surprised if we see every single one that has been reported on iOS 15. So that's basically it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like on this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more iOS 15 leaked features. And of course, the reports on the new features and all that once the first beta of iOS 15 gets released to devs and then of course to the public. So that's it. I will see you guys on the next one.